Hello everyone, my name is Eric Merritt with HomeSmart Realty. Eric Merritt sells AZ Real Estate. And I wanted to go over the mortgage interest rates from 1971 to today because a lot of buyers, especially millennials, uh, think that, well, we can wait another year or two to buy a home and we want to see what happens. Well, its appreciation is still going up at four to six, seven percent per year and interest rates now are in the threes. So if you're, if you're hoping the interest rates to go down, they're not going to go down any further than they already have. I have gotten someone qualified at a three and a half percent FHA just recently. So, and a lot of people are refinancing their conventional loans and getting lower rates as well. But I wanted to go into this graph right here. Um, in 1971, I'm going to go into this. Okay. Historical mortgage rates, averages trends from 1970s to 2019. Mortgage rates today remain at historical lows with over 60% of mortgage holders paying rates between 3 and 4.9% as of 2015. So I'm going to show you a graph. I'm going to show you the numbers here. Uh, okay. So 1971, interest rates were in the 7s. Okay, 1979, it was the lowest uh, 10 point or the average was 11.2 percent 1981 the average was 16.64 percent and it peaked at 18.63 percent in 1981 and then interest rates went down remember gas prices were like a dollar a gallon again in 1986 87 interest rates were getting lower and then we go into the 90s somewhere in the nines and the eights and then around the mid in the 2000, 8.05%, 6.97%, 2002, 6.4%, that's the average. And then we go, so we're in the senses in the mid-2000s, basically. And then the recession comes, interest rates go down because they're trying to fuck the economy back up. And then it went down in as low as 3.66% in 2012. And then it's gone up steadily ever since. And then 2016, 3.65%, 18, it was 4.54%. And now we're back down and around the upper or mid to upper threes. So I just wanted to share that with you because if you're waiting for rates to go down, they're not going to. You're going to still be paying more for a house because of the appreciation than you would be if you were to buy today. So I just wanted to share that with you. And I think it's interesting to know what's gone on in the last 48 years as far as interest rates go, because a lot of people, including people my, at my age and older, we forget how high rates were uh, back in the early 80s or mid 80s, so especially the early 80s, so when inflation was sky high. Anyway, uh, give me a call at 480-999-6061 if you want to get pre-qualified to try and buy a home. Uh, there still are down payment assistance, but I would probably save the 3.5% FHA if you can uh, because the, the mortgage insurance is less and closing costs are quite a bit less without a down payment assistance grant. However, if you do need a down payment assistance grant, they are out there and there's different types where they are forgivable and some that are not forgivable. So you have to make sure in the first three years that if you, whatever you used, is that forgivable? Because some of them aren't. So anyway, just wanted to share that with you, and I will talk to you all soon. Thank you.